Okay, y'all. So, 10 minutes time passed. Hopefully, my, my eyebrows didn't uh, come off or nothing. Hey, boo. So, today, I will be teaching you guys how to do it yourself for tinting and laminating your brows at home first and foremost you want to start off with a clean palette so uh, whatever you need to do to wipe off those drawn on eyebrows or makeup or anything you want to do that and you can definitely go ahead and clean up those brows as well um, I like to have a sharp um, arch so I'm just you know plucking a little bit for you know the best result in the end so that's pretty much what i'm doing here please don't mind my eyelashes they are a hot mess right now but they are fixed now just so you know uh i didn't go outside like this <laughs> but they are a hot mess so please excuse that so right now you know this is self-explanatory i'm just cleaning up those brows making sure they're clean and then we're going to get started with the gold free tint kit i'm showing you all of the products that are in there the mixing cups and the brushes and stuff like that um i'm mixing it up um with the peels i put two of the peels in there just for the deepest color with a little bit of the uh liquid uh, the white tube that you saw they have a um, this tool that I'm using I want to make sure that you brush them up first I did that off camera but I'm just trying to stay alongside the lines um, to me it's like painting so that's what I'm doing here on each of the eyebrows and pretty much all of the other stuff is going to be self-explanatory but I'm just painting and then I ended up leaving it on for about five minutes um, while I'm waiting for it to uh, tint and things like that. So yeah, that's what I'm doing here. So as you can see now, I'm just brushing my hairs up and eventually I'm gonna go ahead and use the cleaning solution with a paper towel to get off all of the extra residue for the tint. Um, I let it sit for about five minutes as you can see it's kind of light and again if I haven't mentioned it already I use the color medium brown for this box and I got it from Amazon no worries though links will be in the description box below um, but I'm just brushing the hairs up and it looks kind of light to me to my liking um, so what I'm gonna end up doing eventually in this video is doing it again <laughs> and letting it sit for about five to seven minutes because I just wanted it to be a little bit darker um so you know you can do this at your discretion i just didn't want to leave it on for like 10 15 minutes because i i never did it before so you know i went in did it for the allotted time that they said on the directions i didn't like how it came out so i did it again so you're going to see that as well um to get to my liking Okay, so as you guys can see, this is the second go around. It looks a ton better for me, for my liking. So I'm brushing all of the hairs up and in place and things like that before I start the laminating process. Um, and I basically saw this from, where did I see? I saw it on YouTube. I'll leave her uh, YouTube channel link below. But I'm like, oh, I thought that was really cool. And you know, how much we spent on waxing on tinting our eyebrows like for me i think it's like 30 to 40 dollars and yeah it looks nice but it's like every two weeks like that is a lot um, when you can do it at home yourself so this seemed like really interesting to me and i just wanted to you know i i do diy stuff myself like i do my hair and stuff myself makeup and stuff sometimes lashes so it's like why not do the eyebrows so i thought it was really interesting to do this laminating process but i really did like the results of how my tinting came out like it looked adorb and sorry y'all i'm just looking at tv while i'm doing it um so 
I don't know what the hell I'm doing now. Oh, yeah. I'm doing the laminating process. <laughs> so, I'm just putting on the solution for uh, the laminating on the laminating kit. And um, basically following the steps on here. It told you to put on the brush the lashes up. And then put on the plastic on there. So that's okay, y'all. So ten minutes time passed. Hopefully my my eyebrows didn't uh, come off or nothing. I'm using the cleanser number four to basically rinse it off and clean off the perm. Essentially what I'm doing, um, I believe you are supposed to let it sit for about three to five minutes. And that's what I did. So, yeah. So, now I'm putting the fixation solution on here. This is number two, step two for the Vossel Lash Lift uh, Eyelash Perming Kit. But we're putting it on the brows, so it's like, you know. We're doing our own thing. <laughs> um, so that's essentially what I'm doing. I believe you leave that on there for three to five minutes as well. And then put the plastic on there. So that's what I'm going to do here. And you'll see that. So between each step, of course, you want to make sure that you're cleaning um, it off with the cleaning solution and you're brushing it up. I just brought it closer so you guys can see it closer, but I'm just brushing it up. And then the next step is step three. This is where I'm going to be putting on the nutrition and I'm just cutting um, the excess hair off so it can be even. That's it. Those are probably not the best scissors to use but you know you use what you have um yeah and i'm just brushing everything all together in this step so this is pretty much the end of the video i hope you guys love this video definitely don't forget to thumbs up this video um again i will be fixing my lashes very soon i have them fixed but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the results and i enjoyed the results and let me know if you guys have done this on your own at home or if you have any better newer techniques uh that you would like to provide definitely leave it down in the comments below but thanks for watching again and i'll see y'all next time bye